What's going on guys, it's your boy Apophis here, and this is part 5 of the Mass Effect. And in the last episode, we found the Mew Relay. And, uh, uh, yeah, Mother Benezia's dead. It was actually really easy, I expected it to be more of a challenge. But, uh, yeah, so we found the Mew Relay, and I think we have to go, uh, inform the council. But anyways, uh, if you enjoy the video, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and let's get into it. I, I, if I'm going to open this map, Joker's going to say, form the council. I forwarded the mission update to the Citadel, Commander. Mm -hmm. We got confirmation on those reinforcements. Perfect. Ambassador Udino wants us to report back to the Citadel. The council's massing a joint species fleet to deal with Saren and his Geth. All right, let's go. Back to the Citadel, Joker. Let's I want the Normandy go. at the head of that fleet. Yes, sir. We should probably tell everybody that the Citadel was built by the Reapers and not the Protheans, right? Just me? Good job, Shepard. Thanks to you, the Council's finally taking real action against Seren. <laughs> well, no the need to be a pompous correct. dick if about Saren it. If Seren is foolish enough to attack the Citadel, as you believe, we will be ready for him. Patrols are stationed at every mass relay linking Citadel space to the Terminus systems. Okay. You think a blockade's going to stop him? He's on Ilos looking for the conduit right now. What are you doing about that? Ilos is only accessible to the Mew Relay, deep inside the Terminus systems, Commander. If we send a fleet in there, the only possible outcome is full-scale war. Now is the time for discretion, Commander. Saren's greatest weapon was secrecy. Exposed, he is no longer a threat. This is over. Uh, what? Uh, are you guys retarded? <laughs> what? Like, it's not over. He's gonna he's gonna bring the age of the Reapers here. Are you? One ship going into the Terminus systems won't start a war. I can be discreet. You detonated a nuclear device on Vermeer. I wouldn't call that discreet. Your Nobody was looking. Your well in the Traverse, Commander. We recognize that. But Ilos requires a deft touch. What we you trying to say? We have the situation under control. If Saren finds the conduit, we're all screwed. We have to go to Ilos. Ambassador Udina, I get the sense Commander Shepard isn't willing to let this go. Fuck no. There are serious political implications here, Shepard. Humanity's made great gains thanks to you, but now you're becoming more trouble than you're worth. Oh, man. You bastard! You're selling us out! Have you been here this whole time? It's just politics, Commander. You've done your job, now uh. let me do mine. We've locked out all the Normandy's primary systems until for the notice you're grounded. <laughs> you son of a bitch. Are you insane? After everything I've done, you still don't believe me? I think it's time for you and your team to leave. Fucking Come bureaucrats, no man. Fucking the bureaucrats. This, with my help, of course. Oh my god, what a... God, what a prick. So we can't leave. How are we gonna get out of here? I've got a message from Captain Anderson. Oh. What did he want? Only said to meet him in that club in the wards. Flux. Anderson, please tell me you have, like, something to get me out of here. Any Equalizing rewards? interior pressure with exterior the flux. atmosphere. Logged. The uh. commanding officer is ashore. Exo Presley has the deck. So, anybody watching this, I, I seriously doubt I'm close to the end, right? There's no way. Sometimes I envy your biotic abilities, Doctor, but then all your people have such skill. While the Asari have natural biotic abilities, not all have the desire to learn to use their abilities effectively. 
Of course, I intended no disrespect to the effort you have put into your training. Pardon. Wait, they do it mentally? Unlike us, we have a fucking a device to do. Whoa. Hopefully Captain Anderson can get us out of this fucking shit show. I haven't seen him in like three episodes. Oh man. Follow the music. Where's Anderson? Oh, there he is. Anderson, my man! I'm glad you came, sir. I heard what happened. The Normandy's been grounded. I know, I'm sorry. I wanted to warn you, but there was no way to get a message to you before you docked. I know you're pissed off right now. Really? But you can't give up. They all think this is over, but we both know it's not. You have to go to Ilos. You have to- oh, I know, that's what I've been hunt. saying. There's only one ship that can get me into the Terminus systems undetected, and she's grounded. Citadel controls locked out all the Normandy systems, but if we override the Ambassador's orders, we can get them to bring the Normandy back online. You can be in the Terminus systems before anyone even knows you're gone. If we steal the Normandy, you're the one left holding the bag. And if Saren finds the conduit, life as we know it is over. Yeah. The Reapers will destroy us. Humans, Asari, everybody. You're the only one who can stop him, Shepard. So I'll do whatever it takes to get you on the Normandy and off this station. What a fucking team player. What's the plan? I can unlock the Normandy from one of the consoles in the Citadel Control Center. You'll have a few minutes before anyone realizes what happened. That's a restricted area patrolled by armed guards. How are you going to get in? Oh, don't worry. Leave that to me. He was a specter. Just make sure you're in the Normandy when the systems come back online. There's got to be a better way. Ambassador Udina issued the lockdown order. If I can hack into the computer in his office, maybe I can override it. He will not just stand by while you use his computer. Well, that's what we'll do when he's on his bathroom break. If he is, I'll just have to think of something. The Ambassador will not forgive this, Captain. You will be charged with treason, a capital offense. We don't have a lot of options. I break yeah. into the Ambassador's computer, uh, or I take Reapers my chance coming back the isn't an option. Citadel control. Oh, man. I break into the Ambassador's office, or Ambassador's computer, or I take my chances with the controls in the Citadel. Let's hope I just made the right call. If you're lucky, the patrols won't catch you. Won't catch I'll you. I'll be careful. You ready to get the hell off this station, Commander? Let's do it. I'll take care of the lockdown. You get down to the Normandy and tell Joker to stand by. So am I gonna have to like full on sprint? <laughs> Pardon me, soldier. Mm, no. Nope, wrong. Wait, was that wrong? No, it wasn't. Perfect. Man, I hope Anderson doesn't die in this game. He is so goaded. Reporter Kalisa Algelani recently attempted to land an interview with Oh, Commander here's the interview. The first Great. human specter. Commander Shepard answered difficult questions, demonstrating that under that military uniform is a keen diplomatic mind. Yeah, get the fuck out of here. Joker! We gotta go! Stand by, shore party. Decontamination in pro- Sir, this is a restricted area. Sir, you can't. Ooh. See? I really hope I didn't just kill Anderson. Freeze! Back away from the console! Fuck. Hands up. Now! No, <laughs> I just got him killed! Oh my god. Woo! Get us 
out of here, Joker. Now. I really thought I just killed Anderson right there. Oh my god. I mean, this is the future. They could get him a new kneecap, right? That was intense, and I wasn't even playing. Right. We gotta go to Ilo's? There she is. So, oh yeah, that's a no to those reinforce. Fuck! We gotta do this by ourselves. God damn it. Oh, flaccid dick chips. <laughs> Why does it look uh, like Commander? Mars? We've got company. Have their sensors picked us up yet? Well, stealth systems are engaged. Unless we get close enough for a visual, they won't have any idea we're here. Picking up some strange readings from the planet's surface. Take us down, Joker. Lock in on the coordinates. Negative on that, Commander. The nearest landing zone's two clicks away. We'll never make it in time on foot. Get us something closer. There is nowhere closer. I've looked. Drop us in the Mako. Go. You need at least 100 meters of open terrain to pull off a drop like that. The most I can find near Saren is 20. 20 meters? No way we can make a drop in there. Yeah, we have that's to try. pretty close. Find another landing zone. There is no other landing zone. The descent angle's too steep. It's our oh, only oh my god. It's not an option, it's a suicide run. We don't... I can do it. Yeah. You know who you're talking to? I can do it. Do you see the fucking shit he pulled you're off on the other planet? The Joker, drop us right on top of that bastard. Oh, this is gonna be a wrap in the Mako. Like, I'm just gonna drop down and just mow everybody down with my machine gun. There's that bastard. What's up, fucker? Huh? You two, keep moving inside now. No way. Son of a bitch. We have to get inside this bunker before Saren finds the conduit. There is no way we're getting past that door with brute force. Saren found a way to open it. There must be some kind of security override somewhere in this complex. We will have to find some way to get it up and running again. Great. All the enemies. Oh man, we gotta go on foot. So there's no way we're getting the Mako through that. That is the Mako's one flaw. Size. Yeah, guys, it ain't looking too good. Not now, Shepard. I'm your commanding officer, bro. See that guy. These things are very inefficient.
Oh, that almost killed me. What the hell are these things? That doesn't look good. I don't have any grenades. door. Door always means something good. Green button means good. Oh, did this just bring us up to here? Yeah. Okay. Never mind. Scratch that. Oh, they're so fast. Nope. Guess we're not going that way. We just do another fucking loop. Hold up, there we go. Oh, we're going down. This place still has power. It must be running off its own generator. This must be the command center for the entire complex. Saren's troops must have sealed the doors from here after he went inside. We will have to figure out how to disengage the security lockdown if we ever want to get inside that bunker. See, they're talking, so you know I'm going the right way. Oh, get the Geth, Geth Prime! Ooh. Oh man, he recharges fast. Ah, uh, another destroyer pounding Garrus into the dirt. If I was a control panel, where would I be? The fuck? Where the hell does this door go to? Okay. <laughs> Security panel. Come, Saren already has a head start. We have to go find him before he reaches the conduit. Unless he's already found it, then we're just walking into a trap. 
That is a chance mm. we will have to take. Hold on. Oh. Something's happening. Fuck. You call me? Too late. Unable to invading fleets. No escape. Sounds like some kind of message, but I don't recognize the language. It is probably in Prothean. This recording must oh, be Oh, that's why we control. understand no it. We cannot understand it. That makes sense. I was about to say, that's fucking English, you idiot. Nah, that makes sense. Because we communicated with the beacon. The message is all broken up, but I recognize some of the words. It's a warning against the Reaper invasion. Of course. Between the beacons and the cipher, an understanding of the Prothean language would have been transferred into your mind. Not safe. Seek refuge. Sign the archives. archives. What's it saying? Can you make out anything useful? Fault Reapers. The Citadel. Overwhelmed. Only hope. Oh boy. Act of desperation. The conduit. All is so lost. So the conduit is the only hope? It said something about the conduit, but it's too degraded to help. We should go. Cannot be stopped. Cannot be stopped. I wish we could just fast travel to the Mako. But I mean, you know, that'd be too easy. I hope in the next game, Shepard can run further. Uh oh. This place feels wrong. To oh me. fuck. And not just because How the hell do we... Oh wait, that other elevator. Yeah. That actually scared me for a second. I'm like, how do I get out of here? No, I think I want to take the shotgun for a spin. right up my alley. Oh god, where am I going? Am I fucking stupid? Yep, I am. Mako! Oh my god, no way. There we go. We're, we're just gonna back our way in. I don't think there's ever been a worse Mako driver than me. I have spent my life studying the Protheans, but I never dreamed I would discover anything like this. Well, you're welcome. This bunker might have been the last refuge of their entire species. Just imagine what mysteries it might hold. Imagine what secrets it might reveal. <sighs> that is so depressing. I don't remember why. Saren, the conduit, fate of the entire known galaxy. I am sorry. I was swept up in the moment. I just hope we have the opportunity to study this place in deep. What are all those things on the wall? Some kind of container? Dildos? They look like stasis pods. The Protheans probably tried to keep themselves alive through cryogenic freezing. Did it work? Something must have gone wrong. Yeah, I mean, they popped this out. This became their tomb. The pods are dead as well as anyone inside. Fuck. All of them? There must be hundreds. Yeah, we could really use a Brothian to help. Is 
See, it just trivializes all ground combat. It's just, it's over like that. That doesn't look right. What is happening? Oh, it's a trap. Saren must have set an ambush. I do not think Saren is behind this. Um. There we go. Can I shoot my way out? No. We've got to go in on foot. God, there's so many pods. I have studied the Protheans for decades, but I have never felt this sense of foreboding. What will we find down there? Whatever it is, we should be careful. No more warnings. You are not Prothean, but you are not machine either. This eventuality was one of many that was anticipated. Oh, this one works. This is why we sent our warning through the beacons. It looks like some kind of VI program. Pretty badly damaged. I do not sense the taint of indoctrination upon any of you. He's unlike the other that passed recently. Yeah, we Perhaps indoctrinated there is still by Sovereign. This is incredible. An actual Prothean VI, and I can understand it. I have been monitoring your communications since you arrived at this facility. I have translated my output into a format you will comprehend. Thank you. My name is Vigil. You are safe here for the moment, but that is likely to change. Soon, nowhere will be safe. Okay, so this is a Prothean AI. Get to the point. Are you some kind of artificial intelligence program? I am an advanced non-organic analysis system. With personality imprints from Kesad Aishan, Chief Overseer of the Ilos Research Facility. Why did you bring me here? You must break a cycle that has continued for millions of years. No pressure. But to stop it, you must understand, or you will make the same mistakes we did. The Citadel is the heart of your civilization and the seat of government, as it was with us, and as it has been with every civilization that came before us. But the Citadel is a trap. The station is actually an enormous mass relay. One that links to dark space, the empty void beyond the galaxy's horizon. What? When the Citadel relay is activated, the Reapers will pour through, and all you know will be destroyed. Oh my god. Oh my god. He turns on the relay. The Reapers can wipe out the Council and the Citadel fleet in one fell swoop. So how does the Condor stop them? That was our fate. Our leaders were dead before we even realized we were under attack. The Reapers seized control of the Citadel and threw it the mass relays. Communication oh and transportation god. across our empire were crippled. Each star system was isolated, cut off from the others. Easy prey for the Reaper fleets. Over the next decades, the Reapers systematically obliterated our people. World by world, system by system, they methodically wiped us out. Oh my god. The fucking Citadel is a mass relay. Oh my god. Some of you wow, must have you just added survive. a lot more stakes. Through the Citadel, the Reapers had access to all our records, maps, census data. Information is power, and they knew everything about us. Their fleets advanced across every settled region of the galaxy. Some worlds were utterly destroyed. Others were conquered, their populations enslaved. Enslaved? Like indoctrinated? These indoctrinated servants became sleeper agents under Reaper control. Taken in as refugees by other Protheans, they betrayed them to the machines. Oh my god, like Saren! Like Saren's Within a few do centuries, this. the Reapers had killed or enslaved every Prothean in the galaxy. They were relentless, brutal, and absolutely thorough. I don't understand. Where did the Reapers go after they conquered your people? Our worlds were stripped bare, harvested by the indoctrinated slaves. 
Everything of value, all resources, all technology <sighs> was taken. Well, not all of it. Certain that all advanced organic life had been extinguished, the Reapers retreated back through the Citadel Relay into dark space, sealing it behind them. All evidence of the Reaper invasion had been wiped away. Only their indoctrinated slaves were left behind, abandoned. Whoa. Mindless husks, no longer capable of independent thought. The indoctrinated soon starved or died of exposure. The genocide of the Protheans was complete. Why? What did the Reapers get out of this? I don't get it. Why do they keep repeating this pattern? I don't know of why either. Over and over. The Reapers are alien, unknowable. Perhaps they need slaves or resources. More likely they are driven by motives and goals organic beings cannot hope to comprehend. Yeah, that's what Sovereign said. In the end, what does it matter? Your survival depends on stopping them, not in understanding them. Thought you said knowledge was power, motherfucker. You said you brought me here for a reason. Tell me what I need to do. The conduit is the key. Before the Reapers attacked, we Protheans were on the cusp of unlocking the mysteries behind mass relay technology. Okay. Ilos was a top secret facility. Here, researchers worked to create a small-scale version of a mass relay. One that linked directly to the Citadel, the hub of the relay network. Okay. The conduit is not a weapon. It it's is a backdoor back door. onto the Citadel. What happened next? Okay. We severed all communication with the outside, and our facility went dark. The personnel retreated underground into these archives. To conserve resources, everyone was put into cryogenic stasis. I was programmed to monitor the facility and wake the staff when the danger had passed. But it didn't. But the genocide of an entire species is a long, slow process. Years passed. Decades. Centuries. The Reapers persisted, and my energy reserves were dwindling. How did you survive? I began to disable the life support of non-essential personnel. First Whoa. support staff, then security. One by one, their pods were shut down to conserve energy. Eventually, only the stasis pods of the top scientists remained active. Even these were in danger of failing when the Reapers finally retreated back through the Citadel Relay. Wow. There were hundreds of stasis pods out there. You just shut them down? You killed them? You were programmed to protect them, not kill them. This outcome was not completely unforeseen. My actions were a result of contingency programming entered on my creation. This is a lore dump. Essential staff about this contingency. I saved key personnel. When the Reapers retreated, the top researchers were still alive. Well, I mean, my was actions are the only reason any hope remains. I'm sorry. The I'm sorry. They realized the Prothean species was doomed. There were only a dozen individuals left, far too few to sustain a viable population. Yeah, there's no way. Yet they vowed to find some way to stop the Reapers from returning. A way to break the cycle forever. And they knew the Keepers were the key. Oh my god. Okay. Okay. Aren't they under the influence of the Reapers? The Keepers are controlled by the Citadel. Before each invasion, a signal is sent through the station compelling the Keepers to activate the Citadel relay. After decades of feverish study, the scientists discovered a way to alter this signal. Using the conduit, they gained access to the Citadel and made the Oh my god. This time, when Sovereign sent the signal to the Citadel, the Keepers There's ignored it. The Reapers are trapped in dark space. Okay, now it makes sense. The Protheans created the beacons to disrupt the signal to the other Reapers that are hiding in dark space so they don't ever return. So the signal never comes, so we're not genocided. Unless Saren succeeds. The ...to bypass all the Citadel's external defenses. Correct. And once inside, he can transfer control of the station to Sovereign. Sovereign will override the Citadel systems and manually open the relay. Oh my god. And the cycle of extinction will begin again. I'll stop Saren. Just <laughs> tell me how. There's a data file in my console. Take a copy when you go. When you reach the Citadel's master control unit, upload it to the station. 
It will corrupt the Citadel security protocols and give you temporary control of the station. It might give you a chance against Sovereign. Wait, where's the Citadel's master control unit? I've never heard of anything like that. Through the conduit, follow Saren. He will lead you to your destination. Oh, fuck. Saren's got enough of a head start. Grab that data file and let's go. Shepard, are you sure? Who knows how much longer Vigil will be here? Even now the projection is weak. This might be our only chance to speak with it, our only link to the knowledge of the Protheans. It is the opportunity of a lifetime. <laughs> are you insane? Fine. It might know something useful. Fine. I will provide whatever information I can. My data banks, however, are limited to information directly related to stopping the Reaper invasion. Fuck. Sovereign beacons, keepers, citadel relay, Prothean scientists. If the Reapers are trapped in dark space, how did Sovereign get here? Exactly. It is logical to assume the Reapers would leave one of their own behind after each extinction. To trigger the a next sentinel one. to pave the way for their inevitable return. Like those in dark space, Sovereign probably spent most of the last 50,000 years in a state of hibernation. Periodically, it would wake to analyze the situation. Okay. Keeping its existence hidden, it would evaluate the state of galactic civilization. And when the time was right, it would signal the Citadel and usher in the next Reaper invasion. But this time the signal failed. The Keepers did not respond. Sovereign's allies were trapped in the void. Alone, it was forced to try and discover what had gone wrong. The conduit had jammed the signal. Oh fuck, wait. Oh man. There they go. The Reapers come from dark space? How do they even survive out there? Well, the we only robots. have theories. The researchers here came to believe the Reapers enter a prolonged state of inactivity to conserve energy. Effectively, they hibernate for the tens of thousands of years it takes for organic civilization to rebuild itself. By retreating beyond the edges of the galaxy, they ensure no one will accidentally discover them. They keep their existence hidden until the Citadel Relay is activated. We gotta go. <laughs> I've got the file. Come on. The one you call Saren has not reached the conduit. Not yet. There is still hope if you hurry. That was a fucking lore dump. Holy shit, my head. So, so, oh my god. I'm gonna have to make sense of that later, we don't got time. All their culture, all their advanced technology, and the Protheans were taken in by the Reapers just as we were. They failed. But they built the conduit to jam the, the sovereign signal. They gave us a chance, chance to survive. It falls to us to make the most of it. So I suggest Back in the Mako. That is crazy. That is a lot to take in. I'm gonna have to sleep on that. That was so much shit. God damn. How in the fuck are the second and the third game gonna get better than this? Like, holy shit, I am hyped. I'm fucking hyped for the next one. Fuck you, rocket trooper. That is crazy. Like, I've seen the trailers for Mass Effect 2 and Mass Effect 3. Oh. 
The only regret I have is that I didn't play these sooner. That's cute. You think your rockets are going to stop anything? Oh my god, another barrier. No, oh, what the fuck? There, the conduit. It's incredible. We don't have time to admire the view. We have to get through that relay, and these Geth aren't going to make it easy on us. That's the conduit? Oh my god, it's huge. I expected it to be smaller. Oh no. Oh fuck. Suck. So Sovereign needs to take control of the Citadel and send out the signal to bring the Reapers back. Woo! Let's get it on! Activate the defenses, seal the station. The arms aren't moving. Systems not responding. They're taking control. Abandon the Citadel! Evacuate the council! What? Citadel control. Citadel control. Do you copy? Nope. Man, we just got here. Retreat. Oh my fucking god, it ain't looking good. So could I just drive through it? Hang on. Things are gonna get a little rough. Oh my god. Come on! Oh my god, we could! We could go through it with the Mako! What happened? Critical failures detected across all monitored systems. Please begin yeah, okay, we're back. What, what the fuck was that? Good to be back. Oh, damn it, the Mako's fucked. Holy shit. Has it always been there? Or did they just put that there? Am I tripping? Yeah, all right, no time to fuck around. This is not a drill. You, you coming? I. Critical. Evacuation procedures. Oh wait, wait, wait. Oh! Everyone's getting turned into husks. You know, a friend of mine asked me what Mass Effect is about. And, uh, oh. Saren, please. Don't do it. Don't give Sovereign control of the Citadel. Oh, no. Oh, no. The Citadel's closing. They're sealing the station. It's turning into a mass relay, buddy. Don't let the enemy ships inside the arms. Oh, you, you can't stop it, man. Yeah, you're not stopping that. Um, 
it just went right through it. But there's still hope, right? We can use the conduit to scramble the signal. Or are we just fucked? Zero gravity. How do you expect? All right, there you go. There you have it. That is cinematic as fuck. For a game made in 2007, this is amazing. Uh, they don't make games like this anymore. Which is a shame. God damn it. I'm having fun with this shotgun. Yeah, so anyways, a buddy of mine... Because uh, I told him I was playing Mass Effect and he wanted to know what it was about. And there's a lot to explain. I couldn't, like, actually tell him. Like, I could, like... Like, I suck at explaining things as is. Mass Effect is just so large and there's so much to cover that I just couldn't do it justice. And this is just the first game. Aw, oh, you dick. Broken. Oh my god. No, no, no. Ow. Bro. Shoot him. God, what the fuck? Yeah, I'd say he's a warlord. What the hell? Ah, you're pummeling Laura now. Pause. Holy shit. Oh, that's great. I still don't have any grenades. Not like I can kill anybody with them anyways. Man, the snipers, like, are so weak. They're such pussies. So how are we not getting indoctrinated by Sovereign right now? This is pretty close proximity. Now it's fine. Okay. 
subpoena ship. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Let's see what it wants me to do. Turn that shit on. Blow that shit up. Oh, they just keep spawning. They keep jumping out of that dropship, right? Yeah. Okay. You think the Geth would learn by now? All right, maybe we should back up. Oh, hey, I have a grenade. Yeah, no. Penis ship down. Oh, there's another Krogan somewhere. There he is. At least he's not a warlord. <laughs> yeah, I could never explain this game and give it justice it deserves. Oh, it's not a turret. Oh, shit. Alright, I just need to, like, take a second. And, like, heal my shields. Because I don't think they've been healed since I got here. Oh, now it gets fun, Garrus? Nope. Ooh, rockets! No oh, way, we can't go this way. We have to go up. You know, this is a terrible time to bring this up, 
But I forgot an aspect that you could have sex with your fucking... With uh, your companions. I completely forgot about that. Might be a little late. We'll probably do that in Mass Effect 2. Unless you couldn't do that in the first one. Sure, we gotta get yeah, down. Access hatch. Let me in. Oh, fuck. Man, Saren, you really fucked the place up. So, the Citadel's lost, right? Like, there's no way we get the Citadel back. Did we even evacuate the council? Say her and I'm coming for you. Yeah, we don't even know where the council is. Did they even get out? I doubt it. That was so fast. Yeah, there you are, you son of a bitch. Is he gonna come back up on the surfboard? There's the surfboard. Gonna go on another villain monologue, or? I was afraid you wouldn't make it in time, Shepard. Yep. In time for what? The final confrontation. I think we both expected it would end like this. You've lost, you know that, don't you? In a few minutes, Sovereign will have full control of all the Citadel systems. Well, the thanks for telling open, me. The Reapers will return. I've still got a few tricks up my sleeve. You survived our encounter on Vermeer, but I've changed since then. Improved. Sovereign has upgraded me. How so? You let Sovereign implant you? Are you insane? What does that mean? You don't understand, Shepard. There is a place for organics in the New Order. The Reapers need men and women of action. Yeah. People like us. Then they're gonna wipe out the rest of us and then leave you to die. Value. You've impressed it. Surrender to the Reapers, and you will be spared. Join us, and we can find a place for you. I'd rather die than live like that. Then you will mm. die. And your companions. Everyone you know and love. Everyone you've ever met. Don't you understand? You will all die. The Reapers can't. God, Sarah's really throwing a Protheans fucking wrench into the Protheans' you. plan. The cycle always continues. I'm done arguing with you. Let's end this. Oh, fuck. Oh, shit. Yeah, at least I. Yeah, Garrus, let's try- oh, man. Let's try not to die. Oh, man, he is burning my shields. Oh, shit! Here I thought it was gonna be an easy ass whooping. There's no way Garrus is dead. Where's Garrus? Give him that, he needs it more than I do right now. God damn. 
This is actually fucking crazy. I've lost shield. Okay, I'm just switching my other gun. Oh, we had a dead end. Oh, Garrus is fucking dead. Aw, oh, fuck. Well, he's not dead. He's knocked out, you know what I mean? Well, use this med gel for myself. Where are you, fucking idiot? Can I shoot the board? Oh, he's got psionic shield. Oh, come on. All right. Where's Garrus? Garrus, can I get you up? You're good to go. Nope. The fuck? I've lost contact. What? I I I can't turn. What happened? I lost my ability to move that way. Well, that's gonna be a problem. Okay, now I've just reclaimed my ability. What the fuck is happening? was so strange. God damn. He just burns through him. Shoot at me, you cunt! Oh, we are surrounded by enemies. Oh my god. Yeah, just keep shooting at Saren. I'll shoot at the guy. Sound like a plan? Yes! Yeah. Fuck you. Oh. Oh, impaled on a fucking... Oh yeah, that don't look good. Impaled on a piece of glass. I'm the fucking best. Oh shit, we're not done. Oh hey Garrus. <laughs> okay, now what? Right. He's dead, right? Those biotic upgrades have to be good for something. Can I see him down there? No. Vigil's data file worked. I've got control of all systems. Quick, open the station's arms. Maybe the fleet can take Sovereign down. See if you can open a communications channel. The Destiny Ascension. Main drives offline. Kinetic barriers down 40%. The Council is on board. I repeat, the Council is on board. Okay, so they did get out. Normandy to the Citadel. Normandy to the Citadel. Please tell me that's you, Commander. I'm here, Joker. We caught that distress call, Commander. I'm sitting here in the Endura sector with the entire Arcturus fleet. We can save the Ascension. Just unlock the relays around the Citadel and we'll send the cavalry in. Are you really willing to sacrifice human lives to save the Council, Shepard? Oh. This is bigger than humanity. Sovereign is a threat to every organic species in the galaxy. 
Such big the decisions. Must be sacrificed for the greater good. Oh my Don't god. Don't waste your reinforcements. Hold them back until the Citadel arms open up. Save the human fleet to attack Sovereign. What's the order, Commander? Come in now to save the Ascension, or hold back? Oh my fucking god. Save the Council, let the Council die, concentrate on Sovereign. The Council's been fighting me every step of the fucking way. Oh my god, but if the Council dies, that means the government's basically fucked, right? Wait until those arms open, yep. Joker. Open we need up. all our ships focusing on Sovereign, even if it means sacrificing the Council. A sacrifice We're... for the greater good. I only pray it is not made in We're all middle of the road. There's all the Lion cavalry. Ships, formation. Wait for a shot at Sovereign. Nothing else matters. I repeat, nothing else matters. It's the Alliance. Open a comm channel. This is the Ascension. We're taking heavy damage. Guardian defenses are over. Kinetic barriers are offline. Commander, they closed the channel. Man, that is not looking good. Choker, the best pilot in the fucking galaxy, ladies and gentlemen. Are we? Okay, good. Saren's still there. Make sure he's dead. Yeah, go down there and shoot him. Go pop a cap in his ass. Oh no, he's not dead. He's not dead. Maybe he is dead. He's dead. Are you sure? Maybe pop two more in him. Oh, what the fuck? No, he's not. God damn it. Garrus has been through worse. He didn't even get pummeled by a destroyer. What the fuck is happening to Oh my fucking god! Oh, fuck. And this station is mine. Concentrate on him. Please tell me no more Gath are joining the party. Oh, and he's like a fucking stalker. God, why? It's like God knows I hate the stalkers. Oh. Yep. Oh, Gath. Focus on the Geth, I'm not worried about Saren or Sovereign taking over Saren's body. Cussing! Fucking shoot the shit! Have that genocidal tentacle monster. Sovereign's too strong. We have to pull back. Sovereign's too strong. He's not doing anything. Negative. This is our only chance. Take that monster down, no matter what the cost. Joker's just sitting here enjoying. Oh man, we're back. Oh, 
kind of ruins the pacing, but it's all right. Still, you little bastard. Focus on the Geth. Serves not really a problem. Weirdly enough. So much shooting. Oh my god, his shields are so tough. Going in. Motherfucker. Well, yeah, fuck you. <sighs> yeah, he's dead now. He's dead now. Now I think the question is, does Sovereign die? Shoot the fucking shit out of it. Get it with everything we got. Hard on my flank. We're going in. Best pilot in the goddamn galaxy. Tactical nuke. Oh, that was fucking clean. No way. We're not dead. So how are the Reapers going to come back? Sovereign didn't get the signal out. Hey guys. Captain Anderson, we found him. They're in here. Where the fuck is Shepard? Where am it's I? It's over. You're safe now. Where's the commander? I'm not fucking dead. Like, come on. There's two more games left. Indeed, the man.
Roll credits. I seriously doubt it. We got your message, Ambassador. What's all this about? These are strange times, Captain. The battle with Sovereign wow, they changed cleaned up everything, the place and we need fast. to talk about what happened to the Council. Commander Shepard did the right thing. We had to hold our fleet back to go after Sovereign. It was the only way. I agree, but this also presents us with an opportunity. The Citadel fleets were decimated in the attack. Their losses have made the Alliance stronger. They can't rebuild without us. We need to take the lead in forming a new council. One with a human chairman at its head. No way. This wasn't some plan for the Alliance to seize power. No. Forcing the other races to accept our leadership is going to cause problems. The other species are scared. They've never faced anything so like this So I killed the council? They don't know what to do. Fuck. They want us to step forward. They believe in us because of you, Shepard. You saved the galaxy from Sovereign. You're a symbol of everything good about humanity. Our courage. Our strength. The ambassador's right. The other races look up to us now. That is such a they 180. They just accept our leadership. They'll welcome it. Given everything you've done... Oh no, I don't trust this motherfucker. He stabbed us in the back. you think our council chairman should be? Oh, I get to choose? Uh, not fucking you. We're about to go into war. We need someone with military experience. Captain Anderson. Someone like Captain Anderson. You make a good case. Captain, are you ready for this? I don't know if any of us are ready. My this, man. But I'll do what I can. So what happens now? The Reapers are still out there. They're coming. And I'm going to find some way to stop them. Fucking good luck. That one Reaper fucking decimated the almost the entire Shepard's fleet. Right. We're headed for war with the Reapers. If we lose, it's the end of all life as we know it. We have to show the rest of the galaxy what it takes to survive. With the support of the other races, we can win this battle. With them behind us, we can stand against the Reapers' return and drive them back into dark space. So how do the Reapers plan on coming back? Is that it? Music's going, I'm liking it. Oh man, that was fucking good. That was good. I am now hooked on the Mass Effect franchise. Oh my god, why didn't I play these sooner? Oh my man, that's crap. How are the Reapers gonna come back? Sovereign didn't get his, didn't use the Citadel of Mass Relay to, to send the signal out to the other Reapers in dark space. What? Oh my god, that's a lot. That's a lot to take in. Ooh, that was really good. I am hyped to play the next game. And uh, since, this, since this was the finale, I didn't know if it was. A uh, hundred subscribers, man. We're at a hundred subs. That is insane. In, in a month, I think, right? In a month, we get to our 100 subscribers. That is insane growth, and I cannot thank you guys enough. And there will be a lot more videos to come. They will be even better. I will see you guys in the next one. Thank <laughs> you.